What's going on, everybody? How you doing? This is Coach MT. Back here with some more incredible financial value here at the Financial Impact Lifestyle Augmenters University, FILA University. And here's some more great just financial value, right? Um, just to let you know, <clears throat> we're still working on our new business credit process. Um, we have two clients in there right now as I was speaking that were actually taking through the process, all right? They, they decided to be our, our guinea pig process and we wanna make sure we have it correct for you, all right? Um, so that's coming soon. Financial Impact is, is launching soon. If you, uh, Financial Impact Academy, if you never, if you wanna be in a position where you never have to worry about money again, Financial Impact Academy is going to change your life. And then, um, then we have our entire program for business owners now that, that's going to go along with the business credit, business owners, entrepreneurs on really setting your business up for success. We partnered up with some really great people in that process. So if this is your first time here, make sure you subscribe to the channel. If you're already a subscriber, welcome back. And today we're going to be talking about collection accounts. And I've talked about this a little bit before, but it's been about a year or two since I've actually made a video about it on why you should not pay a collection account. Okay, why you should not be paying on a collection account. So if you're watching this video and you're paying on a collection account, stop. All right, stop. It's, you, you, you might as well just burn the money up itself. Or just, just put a match to your money and burning up because it's not the amount, okay? So right here, it's showing you the balance, okay? The balance on its collection account. It's not the amount that counts. It's how it's being reported. So because it's, it's being reported as collection slash charge off, that is how it's, that's what's causing it to be derogatory. And a collection account uh, affects your uh, collection account affects your payment history, right? Because you you've had to have been late at least 180 days before it's turned over to a collection account, turn into a collection agency, or turn into um, that type of account. So it's how it's being reported. So if you had a collection account and you owed two thousand dollars, and you had a collection account and you owed a zero dollars, they hold the same weight. It's like a pound of feathers or a pound of pennies. It doesn't matter. They're both a pound. So um, it's how it's being reported. That's the most important thing. So if you are paying on a collection account, stop. All right. You technically do not owe them any money because there, there's no quote unquote signed agreement that you have with the collection agency. They have that agreement with the original creditor. OK. And uh, th th then on that letter, if you ever got a collections letter, there are several violations on that letter that that collection agency may or may not be following. Every time I every time I mark up a collections letter, there's at least four or five violations on that letter where you could collect a thousand dollars per occurrence. Okay, and that's one thing we do for our clients. Um, you could you could find that video um, within uh, on my channel, or I may I may put a link to it here at the end. All right, so collections is not about the amount; it's about how it's being reported. So do not pay on a collection account. The only time I'm going to suggest you do is if you're actually getting sued for the debt. That means you got a letter from an actual law firm, okay? Not a collection law firm because it's two different things. There's a there's a there there are collection law firms. There are real law firms, all right? Collection law firms. This is a law firm is asked for the money. A real law firm. There's a there's a a docket number, right? It's, it's been taken to court. All right, and there may be a judgment on you and they give you an opportunity to defend yourself. And we have a process for that as well, too. So if you're ever getting sued, we have letters and things that you could use to, to, to respond back to them in that process, right? But this is a video about not paying on a collection account, okay? So if you're in any collection trouble right now or any uh, credit trouble right now, make sure you reach out to us. Uh, click on the link in the description area or um, there's gonna be a link after the video. You can reach us right inside the chat. There's a chat box uh, right uh, right on the page. On every page is a chat box. You can reach me. You can also reach one of our team members as well too. But again, if you are paying on a collection account right now and uh, you feel like you are locked up into some type of crazy contract or you know they're gonna, they say, we're gonna do this, we're gonna do that, we're gonna threaten you, just stop paying. Stop paying, stop paying, save your money call us contact us and we'll help you with that with that process okay so coach mt hope you got some value today 
on your credit and we'll be connected with you soon hey how you doing this is coach mt i want to thank you for watching this video make sure you click right here to subscribe to this channel so you don't miss anything click right here on this link to get your process started we have some more great free value over here for you again thank you for watching we'll see you on the next video